Well, the countdown has reached three as the BSU men's hockey team finally opens their season Friday night. Coming off a 20-win campaign and regular season conference title last year, expectations are high once again for the Beavers. After a rare week one by the men's hockey team is itching to play against someone other than themselves. We're at the point right now where we're, we're tired of practices. It's went on too long. We need to play. And uh, we need to play. We need to play at that kind of pace, the physicality, the speed. And um, you can only simulate game situations so much in practice. And that starts with a home-and-home -home series this weekend against fifth-ranked Duluth. Foul next weekend hosting number 19 Air Force. A couple tough non-conference tests. I think they're big. You can't uh, overlook these first few games, even though they're non-conference. You know, last year, non-conference came back to bite us in the butt at the end of the year. So... You know, we want to get out to a hot start. And with a new year comes new faces to add to the mix, with the freshman class fitting right in the first couple weeks. Once they get the experience and once they play more and um, play in the league a little bit and have those couple games and loosen, loosen themselves up a little bit, um, they're, they're going to do great. Also helps having an All-American returning as netminder Michael Bitzer gets ready for one last run between the pipes. Just want to keep moving forward and developing, and if that means uh, you know another season like last year, that's great. I think the big thing is uh, you know just keep growing every day. Youth or experience, it doesn't matter. Beavers are looking for everyone to contribute. There's certain guys you're going to count on, you need to count on, they got to deliver, and then you need a few people, you need a few wild cards. You need a few wild cards, and... Um, when you get a few wild cards, that makes for a pretty good season. So big one Friday night at the Sanford Center. Defending national runner-ups and number five in the nation, Puck drops at 7.07. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.